Where we at, though? All right, so we got a revisit of a classic. At most times Nike. Air Max 95 versus Air Max 1. I personally like both. I'm a huge Air Max fan, but I don't know. Atmos, once again, with another classic 2018 edition. This is it. There we go. What's up, guys? We're live here at Stadium once again. Stadium Goods. We're located on 47 Howard Street, Manhattan, Seoul area. I am Fresco. I know you guys miss seeing my lovely face. But we are here once again. We're doing another unboxing for the Air Max. Being that it's Air Max Day coming up this month, 2018, March, we are taking a quick look at the pre release of the Air Max Atmos pack, which features an Air Max 1 and also features the Air Max 95. Of course, we got them here early at Stadium Goods, so we're going to give you guys a quick live unboxing look at them. So I'm going to show you actually a pretty cool detail about both of the boxes. So on the right, we have the Air Max 95 box, and on the left, we have the Air Max 1 box. But if you combine the two together for the pack, it gives you this Nike, which is actually one of the illest things that I've seen in a long time. And I'm going to give you guys a quick look. We're going to spin this around. Y'all got me feeling like Vanna White with a dark version. We got the animal print here, which is featured on each shoe, but I'll show that to you guys in just a second. So we're gonna turn this one back around. My turn skills are on point. Let's look at the Air Max one first in my immediate left, my man right there. So, box top, as I just alluded to. Let's take these shoes out and please let me know what you guys think. Which one is your favorite? Do you prefer the Air Max 95s or do you prefer these Air Max ones that I got right here in my hand? And yes, these are mine. So, we've got the Air Max One Atmos pack. So the Atmos pack, like I said, features the Air Max 95 but, and the Air Max One. So this is the Air Max One version. Let's take a look at the upper. So we've got the pony here, the faux here, right here in the toe box in the black on black colorway. So there's a variety of animal prints throughout this entire shoe. I do know what I know one of them for sure, but the others, I don't want to quote them wrong. So please, you guys let me know in the comments which animal is represented on each part of this shoe. So we've got the faux here right in the front with the black, full black. We've got the other print here right above the outsole area. I'm not sure if this is cheetah, leopard, one of these animals in the jungle. Shout out to Wakanda. We've got the red swoosh here, right here. See this one right here, you see this? This is a zebra. I know this is zebra here, right here. I don't know. Can anybody tell me what noise a zebra makes? Because I have no idea what noise a zebra makes. If you come to the store and you pull up and you tell me what noise a zebra makes, I got something special for you. But we got the zebra pattern right here. We got what the, I believe is cheetah or leopard right here. Guys, this one in particular, please let me know what this is. I do not know, haven't gotten a chance to Google it yet, but there's a variety of different patterns and materials throughout this entire shoe, which makes it really dope. And then we've got the clean white midsole here, the exposed air unit right there, which is classic to all Air Max ones, and I'm a huge Air Max one guy. We've got not only the black laces that are on the shoe stock, but we've got the red set of laces, green set of laces, and the white set of laces. And we've got the cow that's represented throughout the tongue area. I know that this is definitely cow. I know what noise this cow makes. No, I don't drink milk, almond milk for me. We've got the Nike Air right there on the tongue, and we've got the Air Max right there, if you guys can see. Take a look at this back tab. We've got the Nike Air in green right there on the back tab. You guys can take a look at that. Let's get to this outsole really quick. So I'm a huge fan of gum bottom. We've got the full gum bottom throughout the outsole on this Air Max one. We've got the Air right there towards the uh, heel area. And we of course have got the Nike right in the middle. I'll give you guys one more look. 
at the Air Max One of the set soon to be released at most pack. Let's drop these laces right back in this left shoe. So as I transition over now to the Air Max 95, I'm gonna open this one up. Box top, once again. And please let me know what you guys think. Follow us, like, and share all of our videos. And this is the Air Max 95 of the Air Max Atmos pack. So let's take a look at this upper. You see the difference automatically between silhouettes, Air Max 1 versus the Air Max 95. And as I mentioned, I do not fully know all of the animals that are represented on these shoes. So please, if you have any information, just let me know. Holler at me in the comments. Let me know what each animal is. So we've got the cow right here in the front, as I mentioned to earlier, in the front toe area. We've got the zebra right here. Excuse me. You know what? We just gonna call this Black Panther. We got the Black Panther right here. Shout out to Wakanda. We got the zebra right here. We've also got this, I'm not sure whether it's cheetah or leopard, right there. And then this is the one I'm really confused about. So please, if you guys know, let me know. And no, this is not tiger. This is not tiger. It might be giraffe. It might be giraffe. And shout out to all my giraffes out there. I'm not even gonna get into that. And then we have the full brown faux fur hit right here. We've transitioned down to the midsole. We've got the full white midsole. We've got the exposed air unit. So it's not completely 360 air, but there are, there's a substantial amount of air in regards to the 95 versus the Air Max 1. So you guys can see the air hit here, air hit here, air hit here. As we transition to the back tab, we got another exposed air unit. We've got the Nike Air right there on the back, along with some more cow, Musamu. Once again, back to the Black Panther. We've got the green laces, also comes with red set of laces, black set of laces, and the white set of laces. We're gonna take a look at this outsole here. So it's full black, predominantly throughout the outsole. We have the white and green hit right there in the middle, along with the red Nike Air logo. And we're gonna take a look at the tongue area here. Missed that. We've got the Air Max, which is classic to most Air Max 95s, comes with the outer lay, which is like a tan outer lay color. We've got the red and green on the inside. Lace area here features like a tan goldish colorway with a black line in between. So, as we end out, we've got the Air Max Atmos pack available at Stadium Goods. We've got the Air Max 1 versus the Air Max 95. This is the pre-release. These are set to release soon, but of course we've got them here early at Stadium Goods. We're located on 47 Howard Street, Manhattan, Soul area. Please feel free to stop by anytime. We're open 12 to 8. Visit our website, stadiumgoods.com. If you have any questions or inquiries about anything, Please download the app, the Stadium Goods app is available on iOS and Android. And lastly, follow us on all social media platforms at Stadium Goods. That's Instagram, Pinterest, Google Plus, Twitter, Snapchat, Facebook. Like and share all of our videos on Facebook and on YouTube because I said so. Fresco, salute.